Hello guys, three weeks ago I did an art piece during my study. It turned out pretty well and I was happy with it. I was supposed to do the edit of the video that never came to fruition, never came to me. But since you're here now, I'll just take you through a brief process of what was going on through my mind when I was creating this piece. So for this video, we're going to do a place where we could just the sketching and maybe a bit of the inking. So we're going to do have more of the line work bit. Then maybe in the next video we're going to do the colors and the rendering of the character. So as you can see as I will say this your references, that is what I was using. Now during this process I was thinking it started as a normal art study where I was just looking at the pose from the first from the first reprint that I had but it later came and turned out pretty much different because my brain started operating creatively which really worked out in my favor most of the time it doesn't because it makes you go in a way or in a direction which you had not planned and not expected it to go and sometimes that ends up spoiling the artwork sometimes and you end up starting all over the, the work all over again but for this case we had a very different outcome whereby though I built from the original idea or what it was I was planning to have as the end product something turned out pretty well okay so it had started with the general sketch piece whereby we had the reference the original reference from the posture then now I started adding some bits of African elements here and there and then there is one element that I had actually learned during my first year of study. I had done a bit of sisal rendering, rendering with the sisal pattern. Yeah. So that's what I actually did for that dressing over there, as you can see, as I'm doing those patterns, the way they are crossing crisscrossing each other and handling up it turned out very well I was pretty happy with it and yeah it, it was really interesting to try and have it as my product or as the final outcome later on with the reference I still went back and also did the top of the character and um, when I was doing also the top first, I still had the reference about it. And these references always help me think of how to best approach a design or best approach a character or best approach a particular story that I'm trying to portray. So in the end we were thinking of a little princess out from place in Africa, we always are on the coast and that is kind of her attire. So we did that, I did that, created all the background, background I had done earlier first thing and I sort of did a little bit of color blocking but essentially did place the colors as much, it was just a gray tone and then we also did a bit of the eyes so that I can bring it life I can sort of bring this character to life and I was pretty pretty excited with that with it so if you're new here it would be nice to get to like the video and subscribe as this is what I do we do we do, we do art videos and I hope that I will see you soon when I do the other thing the other section I will be doing the coloring have a nice time.